Okay, I'm sitting here at the Bayer booth with uh, Ruth Matissem, head of uh, Veg Seeds Marketing for uh, EAME and APAC. Um, it's great to be here by, uh, with, with you, Ruth. And can you please explain to us how Bayer is engaging along the full food value chain in order to uh, also hear what the customers have to say and what the grower needs on their side? Yes, of course. So um, Bayer is placing a lot more importance in terms of what we want to try to do through the value chain. So, you know, we're very, very centered on what's important for our customers. And we know from our customers, so our growers, tell us that they need to understand more about their customers. So we really believe that we should be working in partnership with our growers to help them understand, for example, more about the retail trade. So help them understand how retailers think, how they want their produce, what's, for example, what they want to do on quality, on stock turn, on, um, and, and really satisfying their shoppers. And then on top of it, um, we have, we're really much more looking at consumers. So again, consumers are right at the end of the, the chain and we need to understand a lot more about why do consumers want to consume vegetables or not? So therefore, um, should they be look, are they looking at price? Are they looking at flavor? Um, are they looking again at shelf life? And this is really important to a consumer now, especially now with things like food loss. So there's a lot of areas we feel as Bayer we can contribute to help build knowledge, research, um, and how our innovation then you know affects that. So for example, we've not, we're launching uh, organics this year, which is obviously ultimately in response to a consumer need. Okay, great. So a lot about partnership and uh, yes. building bridges with key partners along the value chain. Yes. How does that relate also to? action in relation to sustainability and environment and ethical responsibility from the company yeah. along those chains. So Bayer has very clear sustainability targets across all of the divisions that uh, we operate within. And Veg Seeds again has got additional commitments, um, you know, especially within crop science, for example, we have a real commitment to reach 100 you know, million smallholders. So it's really important that um, you know, our innovation reflects that. So that, uh, you know, for example, we've, uh, we have tomato varieties now, which are drought resistant, which helps, you know, in, in different countries, helps through the supply chain, helps our carbon emissions. So we're really supporting and trying as hard as we can to, to live up to those uh, sustainability goals, which have been defined by the United Nations. Also addressing uh, UN Sustainable Development yes, Goals exactly, yeah. and working towards food security for all. Yes, exactly. uh, and do you think that customers know and understand how the seed industry is active and working on all those different elements or whether we should be more active in that respect? I, I, think, I think they know certain seed companies are venturing into that area, but I think I don't think perhaps they know enough yet, and I think that's also a job that we need to do. So, for example, if you, in Fruit Logistica here, you will see we have the three pillars of, you know, to, on and beyond the farm. And definitely when we look at, you know, uh, all of those pillars, we've highlighted sustainability along the way. Um, and we want to try to get that across and really kind of help people understand what we're trying to do, you know, from a kind of a, an ethical but also ecological perspective um, in terms of our contribution um, you know it's really important our vision is health for all hunger for none and that's absolutely what we're trying to live up towards great thank you Ruth for no your problem. time